Morning guys, Craig with Thirsty's Lawn Guy. I'm trying to price a lawn and a spring cleanup in on January 19th. It's very tricky. I think I'll explain to the customer that um, definitely the spring cleanup I have to see in the spring. And then um, the grass cutting I can pretty much ballpark. But anyways, I'll show you around and uh, I'll see what you guys think. So this is kind of like the side, it's a corner lot. So you got this, it's a pretty big property. You got this. It's, you get so out of quoting this time of year that it's hard to get your mind around how much you charge. Like, I just have to look back at some of my properties and get an idea. But like, that was where I just walked. And it's got a backyard. It's got this incline here. It comes all the way down here, this. I know I'll be able to come up with the price when I think about other properties same size, but just hard to visualize, definitely with the snow. You'd probably be able to visualize without the snow. Now, that backyard kind of comes over here. Snow just, uh, and being January just makes you unsure of your prices but anyways I thought I'd just share so yeah the backyard's pretty big like you'd unsure if you could bring a push more up here like there's these steps so I guess you can't kind of yeah so uh, you just saw that I walked around the property um, I didn't bring my uh, GoPro uh, to throw it on the window here so it's easier, but um, yeah, I uh, just thought I'd share how I got this uh, um, quote lead. So there's um, kind of since COVID and maybe they've had these groups before, but just more like because of COVID, there's like West End Peterborough group on Facebook and then there's like an East End and more people are kind of joining it because they just, I think... They just want to have this community base of um, be able to reach out and speak as a community. I guess if um, anything, any important information needs to be shared, and just kind of like ice rinks available. Um, maybe there's a little bit more break-ins in the areas, so people kind of uh, post on there. Um, maybe just meet, saying hi to people when you're walking um, more with this COVID-19 lockdown 2.0. Um, so. I've kind of, uh, it's been a while since I've posted in Facebook groups because I don't really feel like I need to, but um, I kind of posted maybe a month ago uh, just if anybody needs um, a one-time snow removal that I, I'm local and um, it over a week or two weeks it said that it had a thousand views. So I thought that was crazy. Um, I've never seen that in a group before, so it kind of gave me an idea. Um, I just kind of post early about that I'm taking on new lawn customers and uh, I guess I'm, I'm just very bored doing uh, online learning with the kids and I just I some days I want to think about my business so that's why it led me here to quote today so I'll let you know how I made out um maybe if you got an idea by my video uh, you can tell me what you would charge for the property for grass cutting weekly um, I charge like for the season so I figure out how many cuts it probably needs and then I price it out for like probably 20, 22 cuts for the season out of 26 weeks. And uh, yeah, uh, if you're interested in putting in the comments what you charge um, and give me an idea if I'm off all my prices. Okay, thanks guys. Have a good day. Craig with Thirsty's Lawn Care. Bye.